Hi everybody, Sam Kavaris in the Nimnik Sports Update. The latest uh, Sports Illustrated has a big article, uh, all the NFL coverage obviously, but a big article on Lance Armstrong talking about his um, alleged drug use or possible drug use during the time that he won seven Tours de France and at the same time talks about how a grand jury has been impaneled in the, on the West Coast in San Francisco to hear testimony from both his allies and his enemies regarding whether or not he used performance enhancing drugs, PEDs, while he was competing for the U.S. Postal Team and then subsequently for the Radio Shack team as well. I read the article and, you know, Lance is such a paradox because there are about 70 million people who wear these, uh, uh, you know, yellow Armstrong bands and I'm one of them and have been for a long time because of his fight against cancer and how his foundation really works. In addition to that, a lot of us, uh, me, me included, are skeptical about whether or not he was the only one because everybody in cycling, it seems, is, uh, has some sort of problem with performance enhancing drugs, including the current champion, Alberto Contador. It is an interesting article, I can tell you that. And Selena Roberts, who is a regular contributor to the radio show, is uh, one of the co-authors. She ended up traveling in Europe, uh, traveling all over the world to talk to people. And I can tell you that, uh, you know, I'm skeptical, but at the same time, I do think this article is a little thin in terms of the real meat of the, the crux of the issue. So I would encourage you to pick it up. And right now, uh, if the federal government gets a hold of it and they decide that there is enough evidence, they will indict him. And they're rarely wrong. <laughs> Think Marion Jones. Think Martha Stewart. Uh, both of them as well. Hey, the Florida basketball team uh, plays tomorrow night. That's Thursday night. Uh, we'll talk about that as the week goes on, and they're home on Saturday night at 8 o'clock back in the O'Connell Center. Bad loss to South Carolina last week. And we'll talk more about the uh, championship games that are coming up on Sunday at 3 o'clock and at 6.30. That's uh, coming up uh, a little bit later in the week. For now, I'm Sam Kavaris. That's the Nimnik Sports Update. You can follow us streaming on 1010XL.com from 10 to 11.30, as well as right here on the newscast at news4jacks.com.